Hi, my name is Karen Boniker, and I'd like to introduce you to a new brush pack for Painter Essentials 7 called Suminagashi Ink. So let's take a look at some of the brushes and get started. The first brush we're going to look at is called Enzo. And um, you can use this brush on a layer and with an existing pixels on the layer, so that's important to note. So what it does is it moves the pixels around on the layer and creates the Enzo circle. So this brush is called Enzo. The next brush is called Form. And this brush can be used either on a layer, a blank layer, or on the canvas layer. I'm going to try it now on a blank layer and show you how it paints and it creates these drops of paint as if you're pouring the ink onto the pen, onto the paper. Now once you get enough ink on the layer or the canvas layer, you can start moving those pixels around as well. I'll go ahead and go down to the canvas layer and show you how this works. You can see that it creates a really interesting form and shape to the brush. The next brush is called Marbling Mix. And this one um, I'm going to go ahead and use on the canvas layer. And you can see that it's a circular motion that it creates, but it creates texture along with it. So you can use it at a smaller brush tip size and get less texture and even smaller and you can see how it moves those pixels around or use it at a larger size to create some really interesting gauzy type texture. The next brush is Marbling Mix and this is the brush that I usually start off with if I'm creating a Suminagashi pour and this brush gives you nice even flow with a lot of texture and you could add different colors. And it has somewhat of a transparency to it, which is beautiful as the ink and colors kind of come through. That's Marbling Pour. The next brush is Marbling and I'm gonna use that right on top. And you can see how it moves and creates these wonderful mixes of paint. Can use this with different colors as well and on separate layers. The next brush is called Smear, and this one we're gonna I'm gonna come back to the canvas layer because I really want to move these pixels around to show you. This one with nice firm pressure, you'll get lots of movement in the paint. And with soft pressure, a, a finer tip, and more controlled movement of the paint. And I love the feeling of transparency as you work through the paint mixtures. That's Smear. The next one is Tender Marbling. And this one is a marbling brush, so if you move it in a circular fashion in respects to your Wacom stylus, you'll want to create small little circles. And again, soft pressure will give you a very soft marbling effect, and firm pressure from your stylus, you can get a stronger appearance to the marbling effect. That's Tender Marbling. The next brush is Velvet Blend, and this is a very soft blending type brush where you can use it on the edges to create soft flowing edges and to gently move the paint. The next brush is Wet Pour. This brush can be used on a layer but it's also quite effective on the canvas layer or a layer that has existing pixels on it. And when you 
work with it that way. It gives you a very watercolor effect as if you're dripping ink on top of your Suminagashi pour. Now I'm coming back down to the next brush called Zen Pour and I'm working on a layer here on the canvas layer and this one you can see it creates a, ro a really nice uneven flow so you get some nice hard edges and soft edges and it also will respond to your stylus pressure so firmer pressure you're going to get a little more paint coming out and soft pressure you'll get a very fine amount of paint zen pour so these are the new brushes in Sumanagashi ink really enjoyable to play with to experiment with the different uh, effects that you can achieve uh, one of my favorite brushes in here is the form brush I really enjoyed working with that one um, it was very surprising the way it moved the pixels around and created these really interesting shapes and forms that I could then go into with uh, some of the other brushes such as marbling and create further uh, interesting brush marks. So I guarantee you'll have lots of fun with these new brushes for Painter Essential 7 Suminagashi Ink. Have fun!